Hello there and welcome to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I'll give you five film suggestions for films about family. Let's start. Written by Wes Anderson and Owen Wilson and directed by Wes Anderson, The Royal Tenenbaums tells the story of three siblings who have to reunite after their father announces that he's dying. Made in 2003, this fantastic film gives you a perfect idea of what Wes Anderson's style is. That includes his camera choices, his camera movements, alongside with the symmetry of his visuals, which is very unique of his style. This individual style is what makes me adore Wes Anderson's films. Story-wise, his films tend to be tragic, but the way he applies his style makes them feel much lighter. He shows you the tragedy of life in a funny, vibrant and colorful way. And this is another reason why I love his films. Now let's move on to another wonderful film, and I'm talking about 1986, Hannah and His Sisters by Woody Allen. Set in a lively and gorgeous Manhattan, this film tells the interwined stories of a huge family over the time of two years. What can I say about this film? Once again, Woody Allen's unique sense of humor is applied to comedy, and the result is incredible. As we follow the characters, we are immersed in their lives. We overhear their conversations, we, we hear all the gossip behind their backs, we see all the, all the backstories of each character as the story evolves. If you watch Hannah and her sisters, you're not very likely to say something like, oh, it was just a movie, things like this would never happen in real life, because it's the opposite. Uh, Woody Allen uh, is a great uh, screenwriter, in my opinion, and you will notice that there is a master behind the camera. You will see that all the funny gigs in this film are not merely the result of coincidence or the incidence of luck or bad luck. It's more about how the characters react to it, which is what life is, right? Written and directed by Noah Baumbach, with Wes Anderson on the production team as well, The Squid and the Whale from 2005 is a semi-autobiographical story of two boys who have to deal with their parents' divorce. Baumbach often explores themes like family, separation, divorce, but in this case specifically we see um, how the point of view shifts from the parents to uh, the children and that's very interesting because we see the whole thing from their perspective. Though we never see the kids clash, it's kind of fascinating to see how they both relate to their parents as one of them uh, feels more comfortable with the, their dad and the other one with their mother and how similar they are to them, how they act and how they try to imitate their behavior and their way of life. Based on a novel, 1942 The Magnificent Ambersons was directed by Orson Welles. The film tells the story of George, a spoiled guy from a very wealthy family. His mother used to have an affair with a man named Eugene and now that George's father is dead, Eugene comes back. And since George's mother is open for a new relationship, he stands in their way. Calling this film a family plot would be too reductive because there is a lot of backstory and background uh, that is as essential uh, and as important for the audience to understand. As a matter of fact, the film tells the story of life in the US as the late Industrial Revolution affected and changed the Yankees upper class society. This piece of information is very relevant in the story for the audience to understand better the characters' choices and decisions. Although this is Orson Welles' only second feature film, it feels like the director is more experienced. Alright, so here we are with today's final suggestion, and I'm talking about another film by Noah Baumbach, The Meyerowitz Stories. The film tells the story of Harold Meyerowitz's children who reunite with him in New York for his career retrospective. The film is quite fast-paced and as we follow the characters we feel like we, we want to see more of their lives and more of the story that um, keeps them together. Though dazzling it can be, uh, this film is very insightful and deep, especially when it comes to the relationship between uh, the father and his children. We see these characters who look very extravagant, especially Harold, who's an artist. And another key element of this beautiful film is how the passing of time affects a family and how um, children in the story specifically show their love for their father. Once again, director Noah Baumbach shows you the intimacy of family relationships 
through some nice and funny gigs. So this is it. I hope you enjoyed my film suggestions. Please like, comment, subscribe for more videos about films and my life as a filmmaker and film student in London. I can't wait to be back with a new video and ciao!